Good morning and welcome to Florida Day 13. Today is finally Volcano Bay Day after the stop start, open closed, weather issues, blah. We're going. Oscar is uh, excited. Yeah. <laughs> Very excited. And um, we need breakfast firstly, and we were hoping to just have breakfast at the resort because obviously that would be far easier. But the Mardi Gras dining cards are only available to use in the parks or on City Walk, and clearly we want to spend that money first before we spend other money because we don't want to get stuck with gift cards that we can't spend. So we're going to head into City Walk, grab some breakfast. The options are so limited, like we've definitely found this not just at Universal but at Disney as well. Breakfast options, unless you're doing a character breakfast, then that's it there's like a starbucks and that's about it which does not make us happy because we are breakfast kind of people so we'll go and we'll see what there is and then we're gonna head over to volcano bay finally finally, finally. Yes. we are very excited for this day it's always one of our favorite days of any of our universal trips because it is in our opinion the best water park that we've ever been to so we'll see you at city walk so we've gone to Cinnabon for the boys. I'm going to get a bagel from somewhere else, but um, they've gone for sausage, egg and cheese, bacon, egg and cheese, and we've got two of the classic rolls to share between us, and it was 22.74. So we've all had breakfast and feel much better for it. I did have the bagel, it wasn't the best really, but it was 6 99 so can't really complain about the price. Um, now this is the longest we've ever had to wait for a bus. We are stood waiting, so this is the City Walk like bus station, and we're waiting for a bus to Volcano Bay, and we've been waiting for 10 minutes already and there's nothing. Oh, 15 people saying. There's just been nothing, and now there's a massive queue for Volcano Bay. So we've just hopped over to get into the Cabana Bay bus queue, because obviously we can then access Volcano Bay from there and hopefully this bus will be here quicker yes. <laughs> we'll see but no this is the longest we've ever had to wait for a bus at Universal and um, Volcano Bay officially opens well for early entry at 9.30 and we are at 9.30 now so we were hoping to get there for early entry and be able to ride Crack, crack a Tower a few times um, but we've been a little bit spoiled by the bus situation, so let's see which one comes first. Okay, that may bus just pull up. And now we're at the back of the very lengthy queue where we were at the front 30 seconds ago. We're still getting Pete we're has had the most stellar ideas this trip, haven't you? I keep suggesting time saving, time saving tips yeah. and none of them have come to fruition yet. And I keep, Ali says, I'm t I don't know why I listen to you. I made this suggestion of why don't we just go to Cabana Bay and I said but that is me making a suggestion and she still listens to me so that, I mean that's her own fault. At least we're on our way now. So we've just got off the bus and through here is a security checkpoint so that's similar to the Cabana Bay entrance. So you just got security through here. I don't know why I said that video. And then we'll see what it's like when we get through see if it's further or not. This is a cool little entrance. I think Oscar was saying he prefers the flowers though, is that right? I don't know, this is kind of a This is cool. Feels like Indiana Jones. Yeah. Oh, I think the flowers are just up at the top of the escalator, Oscar. What am I going to do if I want to walk upstairs? Am I going to be like Paddington Bear? Paddington Bear? Yeah. What do you mean? When he walks up the escalator. Okay, there you go, there's your flowers. Get the best of both worlds this way. So it's 10 to 10 and we've just got in. So we're just gonna try and ditch our stuff quickly and get on with it. But no, 
bit disappointed really with the bus service, especially for early entry. You would hope they'd be a little bit more on top of it, but never mind, we are here now and we can enjoy the day. Can we get a seat near the Laughing River? Yes. What a view. Right, we're just going to grab a locker. We're going to put you in there. $16 a day for a locker. I wonder if there's annual pass discount. I'll have to check. And then we'll switch to the GoPro. So, we'll see you in a bit. We've just noticed that you can link multiple tapus to one locker. So, you've just got to link, scan the first band, and then tap another. And then they're all linked, so up to four Tapu Tapus can be linked. So that's good to know from a locker rental perspective. First time in the Laughing River. Yeah. Are we ready for some giggles? Yeah. It actually feels like they've uh, turned all the waves off. Because the, uh, the laser is closed all over. It kind of feels like they've just converted this one into the Lazy River. We'll have to see when we get around the corner. Hi Oscar. Hi. What was that? I don't know. Oh, it's just a flower. I thought it was a plaster. No, it was just a flower. Yeah, it was. The wave at the beginning was not turned on. The wave after the volcano not turned on. No, you still will feel it by now. You would have heard it and felt it. Let's go again. Quite a so we just came around for our second lap, and it looks like the wave is on now. So hopefully this time we'll be a bit more excited. <laughs> Oscar, you look like a minion. Across <laughs> 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 the tower has just reopened as we were getting round to the first little cave bit. We saw the things coming down and we tried to get out round that side, but these guys couldn't swim against the current, so we've had to go all the way around. So we're going to hopefully get on it now before it gets a queue. So we've had a fun morning so far. We've been in the Lazy River, we've done the Moana slide, we've done the Pongu, Pongo races, Pongo races. Then we were able to do Cracker Tower, our return time was up. So as soon as it opened, it had a 25 minute return. It's now up to 145 minutes, so it's quite a wait now. As we were just walking around, we bumped into Mick and his wife who've been watching our vlog. So hello and thank you. Forgot to mention yesterday, actually, while we were at Gatorland, we bumped into Emma and family who've also been watching our vlog. So again, also a big thank you. And now we're just gonna have a little rest. We've activated the freestyle cup, so Pete's just gone to get us a drink and then yeah just a little rest I think before we carry on it's um it's a nice day today I think it's highs of like 28 it just needs to warm up a little bit because it's still a little bit chilly you having fun yeah what's your best bit so far probably crack a tower yeah. should we go get some food yeah so Oscar is fancying a giant pizza for his lunch. We walked past one of the places and I don't think it was one that we've eaten at before because I saw that they did a coconut chicken curry which sounded delightful. That's what I'm gonna go for. Because we refilled the freestyle cup 
We'll grab a drink as well. Although Pete just had a watermelon icy. Are your lips still wet? Slid up. It looked like you were wearing lipstick. I did just finish it white without a straw, so. It looked like he was wearing lipstick. Who you been smooching? Who's he been smooching? Right, let's go grab some food. So it's the Kohola wreath that does the curry and it also does the pizza as well, so that's helpful. Just one stop for us. Okay, we got the coconut green chicken curry. We got the pepperoni longboard pizza with the side of fries and the lava cake. And it all came to, with the annual pass discount, it's all tangled up. 36, 86. And what dingbats forgot the uh, other Mardi Gras dining card? These guys. So this guy. Oh dear. Oh dear. That's annoying. But yeah, let's try this. They didn't have any forks. They only had the spoon and a knife. But let's give it a go. I'm going to try the, just the sauce and the rice first. That just, just tastes like a, a Thai green curry. And then try and get some of this chicken. It's very nice. It's good to have something a little bit different. Yeah, I like that. And then the boys had the pizza last time. It's not spicy pepperoni, Oscar tells me. Pizza or pepperoni? Pizza or pepperoni. So just in case, just in case you need to know. Okay, let's see if it is a lava cake. It's my turn. Oh, it is. That's hot. Is that nice? Yeah. Let's have a look. It's like chocolate. It's like chocolate. Oh, look at that. Yeah. That's a very good lava cake. Chocolate and jam. Oh, I'm going to have a nice meal today. <laughs> Lunch was nice. I think we all enjoyed that. So now we're going to head back to the locker, drop off our bits, put you back away. And then we're going to go to the Waffle. And then it's our second Cracker Tower time in, I put this on upside down, 20 minutes. So we'll go to the Waffle for a bit. And then when Cracker Tower is ready, we'll go do that. And then see where the rest of the day takes us. As we're just walking past, one of the boards says that Crack Tower is full already and it's only 1.47. So if you didn't already have a return time for it, unfortunately you won't be getting on it. That's quite early, isn't it, for it to be full? Well, I, I said to Annie earlier, should we not bother getting another tap it? Because last time when we came, we got a tapping that was like three hours, yeah. but all the other rides were ten minutes, which meant we actually couldn't ride anything else. Yeah, because you can't queue at all. Because you can't queue at all. It's got a ten minute tapping that you have to wait until it's arrived now. So we ended up not being able to ride anything. Whereas now, we did tap in again because we thought we should. Yeah, we're going to have lunch and stuff. Um, but all the other rides are, are right now. Literally every single slide is right now. So it's obviously worked in our favour this time. Yeah. Shame though that the ride is full completely already by 1.47. So I guess the point to that is do arrive early and tap in. Although this morning I'm not sure if we said did you say Crack Tower was down? I don't believe it. It was actually down for at least the first hour before it came up and running again. Well, annoyingly it was open when it was open for early hours. But because of the bus stuff this morning that we obviously didn't get here for early hours. By the time we got settled, it was five past ten, and then it had gone down. Yeah. So when but it was open like for everyone else, yeah. it went down for an hour. So, not having the best of luck today. Them Disney buses. <laughs> Must have been a Disney bus driver. But yeah, let's go and get on with some extra bits. Make the most of the day. So Cracker Tower has definitely redeemed itself, hasn't it, Oscar? Yeah, we did it three times in a row. Three times in a row. Yeah. So it 
obviously said we we mentioned earlier that the ride had been full when we actually went to tap in for our return time it looked like slots had opened up again because people were starting to tap in and it was a, a 105 minute wait something like that but it was absolutely dead like no queue at all so when we got up there uh, we obviously got straight on and then when we went round to the top they were like do you want to ride again uh yeah there was literally nobody there that happened three times yeah and then third time then obviously there were people there so clearly we hopped off but yay that's what we wanted to do this morning yeah we thought we could have been doing that at two o'clock in the afternoon there are still spots now um, again it's showing a two hour wait but because of the time we need to start packing up and stuff we're not going to get a chance to rise it again sorry it's so cold so cold the water's so cold um, oh, it's making me jump um, so we'll go and do some other things Oscar wants to go in the wave pool don't you mum yeah. and then see his beloved freestyle cup he dropped it in the sand <laughs> didn't he the sand is definitely anime history the, the sand went all over his cup. Poor PT, he's gone to clean it out now.
And he cannonballed. After the wave. After the wave. Yeah. It was just no stopping him. And he went flying up into the back of this kid. And no, it, was, it wasn't an adult. It was an adult. No, it was the kid first. first. Well, the back of a teenager first. He was like, sorry, 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 because he couldn't control himself. Yeah, but And then the when the teenager moved head. out of the way, he went straight into the back of the dab that was in front of him. It was so again. funny. Thank you so much. Thank you. Enjoy your day. Thank you, you too. It was hilarious. And Oscar was just going, yeah. I'm terribly sorry. I'm truly sorry. <laughs> yeah, because the wall was right next to me and I tried to go to my right, but I couldn't somehow. It so. happens. That's what happens. It's yeah. so full it's in there. Like, watch out, watch out, watch out. <laughs> Thank you. So that was fun. Very funny. So now we are heading back to Dockside. I think it's at this point that we really miss not staying at Cabana Bay because within 30 seconds you'd be back in your room. So if you are going to be coming to Volcano Bay and you have a choice of resorts, we would really recommend Cabana because it's great for proximity to Volcano. But now we're going to have to, I think we can get our own bus to Dockside, we think. So we're going to have a look and then we're going to have showers and stuff there before we head out to islands because we've got dining reservation booked for Mythos, which we're all excited yeah. for. Best theme park restaurant, is it? I don't know. If it, if it had garlic bread sticks, then it would be. <laughs> or garlic bread. That's the decided factor. That's the decided. That's Oscar's uh, benchmark, that. So yes, we will come back when we're in a better state and on our way for dinner. I'm always so happy when we get to the moving walkways. Yeah. Then I know that we're nearly there. Look at all those that are walking. I'm sorry. <laughs> we think we've got time for one ride before dinner, so we're going to head into our Islands of Adventure anyway, because that's where we need to be for dinner. We'll see what we can jump on. And then have dinner. Like, I'm hungry now. I don't know what it is about the water parks or swimming, but it always makes you hungry. Or for me, it makes me feel hungry. So, yeah, it's like the perfect evening as well. It's, is it nearly six o'clock already? Five to six. Five to six. And we're still in shorts and t shirts. It's like perfect temperature. Oh. I love these Florida evenings. Isn't this just a stunning view? We're gonna have a gorgeous sunset, I think. The adventure begins, Oscar. 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 The adventure begins, Oscar. 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 Yes. You, 
very brave. Yeah, two words to describe that ride. Boring philosopher style. <laughs> boring? Yeah. Well done. We love that he can ride with us. Sometimes it takes him a while to warm up to something. But you did it. Yeah, that's all I've managed. Excellent. Well done. Oscar is a fan of both? Yeah, I think it's a fan of both. It's really good. And this is where we're having dinner this evening in Mythos. Awarded world's best theme park restaurant. Let's see if it was as good as we remember. Oh, thank you very much. Wow, it's cool in here, isn't it, Oscar? Do you remember it? Wow, look at the faces. For my starter, I've gone for the Spanakopita. It was so nice last time. And uh, Oscar doesn't get a starter. The kids ones don't really come with a starter. But I'm sure he'll enjoy eating these, like, fried pita chips and I thought I would try the lamb meatballs knife fork and spoon again just like last time because I'm boring and it's uh, a grilled cheese with pancetta, a slice of pancetta on top and tomato soup. I've gone for the, um, I think it was balsamic grilled chicken breast with parmesan fries. It's got bacon and lots of other yummy things in there. And Oscar? Chicken tenders. Chicken tenders. Shocker. Yeah, shocker. Shocker. The bill has just arrived and it is 103.88 and we are absolutely stuffed. Our meal tonight was so good. We were just saying though, a little bit disgruntled about the second apple juice charge, especially when sodas are refillable. That's not ideal. We're just leaving Mythos and we had such a good meal. Did everybody enjoy it? Yeah. Yep. Mine was absolutely delicious. Really enjoyed that. It's pretty dark now. The park closes in 15 minutes. Oh god. Yeah. And we are trying to run around because Oscar also wants to try Dr. Doom's fall. Yeah. Hopefully it won't be a long way. <laughs> but you know, what do you want to do after having a massive meal? Get thrown in the air. Get thrown in the yeah. air. Of course. Oh my god, this view! Oh my god, oh my god. It's so pretty! Oscar is hustling me. He is hustling. Right. Let's go do Dr. Doom's Fall. Hopefully we won't see our dinner a second time. It is tall. Wow. Oscar, you're such a brave boy tonight. Oh my god. What did you think of Doctor Doom? It's so good. The beginning was like, ah! Scary, but after that it's so short and tame. Yeah. It's really good. Ah! Oh, what a successful evening. A nice dinner, two new rides for Oscar. Really happy with that. I just had to show you that nighttime view before we finish because it is stunning. Right? I always thought those lights came out of Doctor Doom. They're coming out of the Discovery Center. 
dresses. Oh, makes more sense. Who knew? So, we're gonna finish the night. We're gonna head to City Walk. We're gonna grab some voodoo donuts for the morning. Yum. So we hope you've enjoyed this vlog. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and a subscribe is always appreciated. And join us for our next vlog where we are going to do more oh, islands of adventure. Yeah. All the rides. All the rides. All the rides in Islands Including of Adventure. Including Yeah, they're the best rides. So stay tuned for that. And thanks again for watching. We'll see you again soon. Bye!